Hello, Fire Signs. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Welcome to Star Tarot. I hope you are doing well. Ito po ang inyong reading for August 19. This is for the collective po as always. So, hindi ito magra-resonate with everyone. Kunin nyo lang po kung ano yung magra-resonate sa inyong sitwasyon. Thank you. And also, maraming salamat po kung kayo po nakapag-subscribe na sa aking channel. Thank you for your support. And if you are new here, hello, welcome. And please subscribe, like, share, and hit the notification bell po para updated kayo sa mga susunod ko pang readings. Thank you. So, let's call on your angels and your spirit guides po para assist tayo throughout this reading. Thank you. Tignan natin po kung ano yung mga mensahe para sa inyo ngayong August 19. We have the Medicine Guardian. Be open to healing information. Oh, ang iba uh, sa inyo is going to, you know, receive some kind of advice. Maybe, maybe an advice from the doctors, an advice from healers, traditional healers maybe, or maybe energy healers. Um, ang iba sa inyo is going to receive advice maybe from other people na naka-experience na ng the same uh, ailment kung kung meron man kayong pinagdadaan ng uh, sakit or any you know physical or mental or emotional na na karamdaman so we have arrows surround yourself with protective energy ayan so you are going to surround yourself. You are going to choose to surround yourself with positive people, positive experiences, positive situations ngayong araw. And you know, uh, kung kailan kayo mag-step back, you know when you're going to turn your back on something or on someone. So your next message is, Great teacher, learn from spiritual experiences. So I feel that you are going to encounter a spiritual teacher a life coach or or a spiritual person na where you are going to learn something you're going to learn more about your spirituality and and also ang na kukuha ko dito is you know you're going to capitalize on your experiences on your spiritual experience that is what you're going to lean on Yun ang, yun, yun ang paghuhugutan ninyo ng lakas, you know, yun ang paghuhugutan ninyo ng, ng inspirasyon as you navigate your life uh, ngayong araw or simula ngayong araw, yung, yung inyong spiritual um, experiences. So, that's beautiful. So, tignan natin, um, fire signs, kung ano pa ang mga mensahe para sa iyo ngayong araw, August 19. So, we have the Four of Cups. Uh, dito sa Four of Cups, there are opportunities coming in. Uh, maaring trabaho ito, maaring opportunity to learn. Maaring, ang iba sa inyo is receiving an opportunity, you know, towards uh, your healing. Kasi dito, be open to healing information. But dito, tignan mo yung hitsura ng babae, parang wala siyang pakialam parang walang dead ma siya kung kahit ano man nangyayari sa paligid ko I don't care yung parang ganun yung nakukuha kong vibe sa kanya but ang sinasabi ng, ng card na ito the, the side note of this energy is before you decline anything before you decline any kind of opportunity that comes in uh, sa buhay mo ngayong araw Try to take a look at it. Yeah, give it a chance. You know, give it a chance. Kahit anumang opportunity yan, depends on your uh, situation. Kahit anumang opportunity yan, take a look at it. Bigyan mo naman ng konting oras yun. And I feel like that's, that is what you're going to do. Yung, you're going to shift your your perspective dito. Kasi parang ngayon, yung current na nangyayari sa iyo, maaring dead maka lang sa mga nangyayari sa paligid mo because parang wala kang amor, wala kang alabaw, wala kang gana, you know, na napakialaman, na maging aware ka, maging sensitive ka sa mga nangyayari sa paligid mo. But in this case, uh, during this period, I feel that your mindset is going to shift I feel that you are really going to uh, take a look at the opportunities coming in and you're going to give 
those opportunities a chance na matignan man lang you know madisect mo man lang so that you can decide if you're going to take it you're going to embrace it or you're just going to let it go so ayun tingnan natin kung ano pa we have five of cups tingnan mo yung energies dito na lumalabas look at her and look at her parehas parang walang gana nang para itingnan mo siya yung yung bang nawalan talaga siya yung yung pakiramdam niyang babaeng ito dito sa card is nawalan siya so uh, parang feeling niya na wala ang buong mundo sa kanya kasi look at look at her meron siyang full cup dito very vibrant very inviting but she's not looking at it at all yung nakafocus lang siya doon sa mga nawala so i feel that yung current uh, ni energy mo dito at saka dito are the same kaya ka nakaganito walang pakialam walang amor sa mga nagaganap because maybe you lost something maybe you lost uh, something or someone may nawala sa iyo and you regret that you regret that uh, ng sobra kaya parang nawalan ka ng ng gana sa sa buhay nawalan ka ng gana sa iyong uh, sarili you know but yung message ng five of cups here is take a look at the ones that you have left kasi you may realize na yung mga nawala sa iyo is you lost them because they don't serve you anymore kaya and kaya din hindi siya uh, napunta sa iyo because it's not meant for you or it's not for your best interest kaya ganoon but whatever left sa iyo yun ang para sa iyo even though tatlo yung cups na, na nawala sa iyo but you have uh, two full cups dito remaining that means that it's not the quantity but the the quality of what you have diba kasi even tatlo yung nawala sa iyo but i-compare mo siya sa laman ng dalawang cup na natira sa iyo it might be that nandun yung wish fulfillment mo it might be that nandun yung opportunity na magpapa lago pala ng negosyo mo na magpapa uh, boom pala ng career mo it might be that nandun pala yung yung bagay na makakapagdala sa iyo sa success, di ba? So, if you don't uh, focus on what you have, then you might lose everything then, di ba? So, yun ang mensahe na pinaparating sa iyo ng Five of Cups. So, what else? So, we have the Empress. Tingnan mo. So, if you focus on these two cups na maaaring nandun yung mga um, opportunities na naman makakapagdala pala sa iyo sa the pinnacle of success and look at the empress card yes. this is the the beginning of success you know this is material success this is financial abundance financial success so maaring yung mga opportunities dito sa four of cups and dito sa uh, remaining two cups mo those are the ones na makakatulong pala sa iyo yung pala yung mga opportunity na magdadala sa iyo sa tagumpay, di ba? Yung pala yung mga bagay na mag maggaguide sa iyo para makarating ka doon sa iyong destiny, para sa iyong life purpose. And this is a worldly success I'm seeing here for you, um Aries Leo Sagittarius. So take a look at these opportunities na meron ka sa harap mo. Take a take a look at them closely because that might be yung seed na pagsisimulan mo para sa iyong worldly success you're going to create your success here magsisimula ka dito ng ng inyong tagumpay so you would know na yung na yung two cups pala na natitira mo dito sa five of cups and dito ang opportunities dito na papasok sa you sa four of cups you wouldn't know that that is the seed di ba para makapagsimula ka pala ng iyong financial security and stability dun pala siya magsisimula use these energies na na lumalabas dito ngayon sa inyo to inspire you pa 
to move towards your success, to move towards your destiny here. Because financial abundance, financial security and stability is waiting for you here. So fire signs, Aries, Libra, Sag Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, that's all I have for you today. I hope nakatulong ang reading na ito in some way. Thank you for watching and love and light.